Lee and Cindy, a controversial issue here across the state as Republicans are leading an effort to repeal its use in statewide elections. However, here in Portland, question A is seeking to expand that. Now, if if it passes, ranked choice would be used not just for the mayoral race here in the city, but for city council and school board races too. I'm one of the many councillors. I canvass for that. I think we need to expand opportunities for people to participate in our democratic system. And ranked choice voting will bring that in. Now, there is no formal group opposing this measure here in the city, Lee and Cindy. Zach, a lot of people across the state may have seen folks gathering signatures outside the polls to repeal ranked choice at the state level, but we're now hearing reports that they were not allowed to in Portland, right? Yeah, that's what we're hearing again. This effort led by the Republican Party here in the hopes of getting those signatures across cities and towns in Maine to get this issue on the ballot. However, just this afternoon, I spoke to Maine GOP chairwoman Demi Kazunis, who says that the city of Portland did not allow them to do so at their polling locations. In fact, they even took measures to uh, emergency legal measures to ensure they could be here. Here's more of what she had to say just a little upset about it because it's free speech. We have the right to go ahead and, and get petitions and signatures. And this is not the way, you know, the biggest city in Portland should be reacting to signature gathering. Now, to be clear here, they have since been allowed to be at the table. In fact, right here next to me, there's someone gathering signatures as we speak. Um, but the city did not return our request for comment. Uh, Kazunis, however, says that the city's uh, reasoning here had to do with question A itself. But coming up in the next half hour, we'll have much more on this election coverage, including how this first primary in two decades is having a big impact on turnout. Lee and City. All right, Zach, thanks.